overnight last night. A tropical storm Colin has now developed offshore of the Carolina coast, so any travel plans towards the Carolinas, keep in mind that they may make some variations due to the dynamics in the atmosphere. If you're headed towards the beach, there's still going to be a chance for a spotty shower pretty much each day for your holiday weekend today into Sunday afternoon as well as into Monday. But most of these storms have been happening with the heating of the day. But the storms along the Gulf Coast also have that element from that low pressure center that's been riding in the northern Gulf of Mexico for several days. This is the latest track on Colin. Notice it's moving northeast at eight miles per hour. It has 40 mile per hour winds. Also a quick update on Tropical Storm Bonnie moving over Central America as a tropical storm. Potentially it's moving west at 14 miles per hour, but it could potentially reemerge in the Pacific as a category one hurricane. So we're already getting pretty busy in the tropical weather department, but none of these tropical weather features are going to impact us directly. Now the low pressure center that was riding in the northern Gulf of Mexico that we're still of course keeping tabs on that low is still adding rain and thunderstorms to portions of Texas and coastal Louisiana. It'll still add some more fuel too to the pot as you look at Louisiana around 7 p.m. tonight. Mobile Bay into uh, Florabama. There are some thunderstorms likely a little bit stronger too along the Gulf Coast. So we'll have intermittent spotty showers. Nothing to cancel your day, your Saturday over. We still do have a lot of heat and humidity combined on Sunday afternoon too, but more thunderstorms expected to develop because I think that low that's in Texas is going to slowly kind of nudge eastward and be a moisture source for us for the next couple of days. It's in the 70s to start, you know, that rain that they've been having, thankfully, in Texas from that area of low pressure has taken the temperatures down in Texas as well. And so none of us are breaking any records for heat, thankfully. Looking ahead into your holiday, July 4th, Monday, temperatures will get up to 90 degrees. So I do think that there will be some showers and thunder showers in the afternoon that do start to wane as the sun sets. You know, sun doesn't set until later in the evening. Thunder on the mountain when it's nice and dark. So I think you should be good to go for the fireworks. Just any afternoon plans, you may have to have an, a, an inside uh, plan.